allow me to tell you something that you know not. When you see somebody close to you, they are forever against you. They are forever pretending and you can tell they are pretending. Let me assure you that person in the future can be a serious danger into your life. There are those who, when they look at you, they'll be like, you know what? I will not let go. I will not let go until I see this person dead. It either me or them. And but but of course, such words can come from direct witches. There are those who are not willing to let go. That's why sometimes uh, when I hear Christians saying, oh, hey, the Lord said, love one another, love your enemies. No, 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 no. That is true. But of course, we, we do not need to be stupid about it. First, you must put God. God Almighty must be the one to approve them to be close to you or not. Because you drop your guard, they won't waste time, but they will hit you. They're going to strike you. There are those, as much as you think that, you know, I don't want them, uh, anything bad happening. There are those who God, listen, in fact, in everyone, even if it's for those who die young and you wonder like, yo, why did they die early? Yo, they didn't repent. Listen, God Almighty has calculated for each and every one of us. No ways you're going to die without you having to be warned. For repentance especially. It could be that time when you ignored, maybe it was a year ago. That time in his calculations, God is a perfect God. He knew that it was more than enough time for you to repent. Meaning, anything after that, you are just ignorant. He spoke about Jezebel in the book of Revelation. I have given her time to, re time to repent, but she is unwilling. That those who keep on performing witchcraft, those who keep on cursing you verbally, those who keep on sabotaging you, and in their life, in their mind, they say, I will not let go. Over my dead body will I let this person go. So you see, no matter how God will send his Holy Spirit to convince that person to repent, they don't. And as a result, God Almighty will deal with them as he sees feet. Anyone who has made a vow saying over their dead body, I pray, may God Almighty judge the situation and deal with it as he sees perfectly fit. I pray over your life, your situations in Jesus name. Amen. And remember, you can book a consultation with me. All the details are in the comment section below. See you next time.